All right. Now we're doing Free Code Camp, JavaScript Algorithms and Data Structures Beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 57. All right. So now we're going to create another property in our object called button functions. We're going to give this property an array containing the three functions assigned to the onClick properties in the GoTown function. We're going to remember that these functions are variables, not strings, and should not be wrapped in quotes. All right. So it's pretty much going to be exactly like this, but instead of these strings, we're going to put these variables in. So let's uh, put a comp. Let's actually let's uh, copy this up to uh, from all of 22 up to the end of 21. Copy that. Let's put a, another. Let's put another comma like that, and then let's do a control V after the comma. All right. So let's just get rid of everything in here since uh, it'll be easier that way. And we're going to call this instead of button text, we'll call it. Uh, button functions like that. And I accidentally deleted the other side of that, but here we go of the um, brackets, but there we go. And now since it's like that, all we got to do is copy paste these ones because they're all just one word. So it's, we don't have to like select and avoid things and whatever. So just copy paste, go store, and then we'll do a comma. And then we'll do copy, go cave. And then we'll copy fight dragon. And then we'll put a comma after go cave. Oh, a comma after go cave and put the fight dragon. Let's put some spaces in there just to make it look a little nicer. Right. And so that should take care of business. Let's check the code. Looks good and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 58 and we'll see you next time.